Hey everybody, this is about to be a really fun quick video. We're shooting baby powder with the Desert Eagle. I actually got this idea from the Heavy Metal Guns and Outdoors channel where they shot some baby powder. I'm gonna put a link right here to their video and also in the description down below. Go check out their video shooting some baby powder. In this video, we have five jars of baby powder and then we're shooting the Desert Eagle in 50 AE with some Hornady 300 grain XTP bullets. But what I'm hoping we can capture in the footage is I've opened up all these caps and they spray baby powder pretty easily here. You just squeeze them and they shoot that out there. You can see kind of in the holes there. But I'm gonna line these up. We've got five of them. Shoot them end to end with the Desert Eagle. See what happens. Should be a fun video. Let's set it up, shoot it with the Desert Eagle, see what happens. All right, now we got all the cameras rolling. Here we go with the Desert Eagle versus the baby powder. Let's see what happens. This should be a whole lot of fun. Three hundred grain bullet versus the baby powder. Gonna shoot this thing one-handed here. Definitely got a lot of baby powder in my mouth there, but let's take a look and see if we can figure out what happened to all that baby powder. None of the baby powder left on the table there. And then we got one, two, three, four, all five of them down on the ground. This one's got a clean hole in the front and a rip through the back. That one has got a bigger hole in the front. That one has a hole in the front hole out the back. If you look, this one does not have a hole through it. So I'm wondering if we actually caught that bullet. So I put them back up here. First one, hole in the front, hole in the back. Second one, hole in the front, hole out the back. Third one, hole in the front, hole out the back. Fourth one, hole in the front, hole out the back. Then this last one just has a little dink on it. So, I'm wondering if we caught the bullet. Actually, you know what? This one may have been the fourth one. Because the exit is pretty weak. The first four had holes in the front and out the back. And the last one just got dinked. And I couldn't find the bullet anywhere on the ground. So, 50 AE Desert Eagle goes through four things of baby powder. Just to finish off this video and have a little bit more fun, let's go ahead and finish these things off with the 500 Smith & Wesson Magnum. Let's go load that one up. All right, now here we go with the 500 Magnum 400 grain bullets to finish off this baby powder. Ooh, I can still taste that baby powder in the air. At least it smells better out here. Let's shoot him with this baby, see what happens. I think that one gave us a little bit better smoke cloud. What do you think? Just like before, none left on the table. And we got one, two, three, four, five left on the ground. Let's put them back up on the table, see if we can figure out what happened. So here's the baby powder. You can see the first one has two clean holes in it. Then it gets a little dirtier as we get along. And then the last one again, no hole in the front, but it looks like the bullet deflected and kind of grazed the back. I don't think we caught either of those bullets, but just to be on the safe side, let's go dump all this out. See if any of the bullets just happen to be in one of them, just to make sure. Got this plate out in the yard. We're just gonna start dumping, see if we can find a bullet. Here's the last one. No bullet yet. We 
We didn't catch either of those bullets, but I had to check just to be sure. This was a real fun video shooting those two big pistols versus the baby powder. Thanks for watching the video, guys. A big thanks to my friend Jeff and a big thanks and shout out to Heavy Metal Guns and Outdoors. We appreciate all your support. Everybody go check out the Heavy Metal Guns and Outdoors channel. Don't forget to subscribe to the Hooty Hoo channel if you haven't already. Check out all the links in the description down below. Stay tuned for the next one, guys. Hooty Hoo!